This is the wrong way. Good morning. It is Saturday and I don't know, like seven o'clock, something like that. Maybe in 6.30 and 7. I was going to go back to bed. But well, I'm really better going back to bed. I came down, fed the boys. And I'm like, oh, boy. So, okay, we're going to a picnic today. I had a bit of a hike, walk slash hike, um, and then a picnic. And I made stuff yesterday. Like, uh, some homemade falafels, which are amazing they they taste so good the only thing is they're a little bit crumbly i mean i'll show them to you later so i might change the recipe a little bit next time but i'm definitely making it again anyway they were still on the side because on the cooling rack because i made them last night so i started putting them away and then i made this baked oats i started putting those away <coughs> pardon me and then i was like oh there's my clothes in the washing machine so i put them in the tumble dryer so and then i was like there's no point going back to sleep so all i did was coming down i'll start and starting this new book called bad love yeah i got it in the works because i'm a classy lady and i was eating watermelon i just had a big slice of watermelon which i was thinking maybe it's a bad idea because i always need a wee like not a wee, like 20 million wees if I eat watermelon, but if it's only 7 o'clock, we're leaving at 10.30 to go to the place. So hopefully by then I won't be needing it. So, yeah, I'll show you what I pack for the picnic. I kind of want to make like a lentil pate, so I might do that. Or I might just buy some, you know those small pots of hummus that you get like three pots in like one packet and then... And it's like reduced fat. It's still going to be quite high in fat, but it's reduced. If I had tahini, I would just put some hummus together. Maybe I do. Do I have tahini? I don't think I do. But anyway, I'll show you what I, pe what I pack for my picnic. And then we've got some, like, cakes and... Hello, Simbi. <laughs> Simbi's here. Simba! Hey, Simbi! He doesn't care, just run away. Um. Oh, yeah, I'll show you what I pack and then we're walking up to this high hill sort of thing i can't remember what it's called again um i just call it the suicide spot because a lot of people have killed themselves like jumping off of there but i i think that the view is going to be absolutely beautiful from up there but anyway i will show you um so that's what's happening today and then at five o'clock we're going to a friend's house and they are making a lot of vegan pizza much excited and um, they came over last week and that's one of the reasons why i didn't really um film much because on saturday we went to get the piercings which are this top one and this one i love them i just can't wait to um put black jewelry in so that's what we do, did on Saturday, and then we did like shopping and that. And then on Sunday, we had people over for a barbecue. So I was, I'm always like so busy when people are over, I'm trying to be a good host and whatnot. So I didn't really have time to actually um, do any filming. So that's why there was no weekend vlog yesterday, because it would have been like five minutes on Saturday of me complaining that my piercing hurts. I forgot how painful they are. But yeah, so. Um, that's the plan for today. Hey, Simbi. Hey. Say hello. Hey, Simbi. I love you. He's so cute. He's been cuddling with me last night. So yeah, I told him I had to go back to sleep a little bit if he wants to rest. Um, and then we're gonna pop to Lidl because I need to buy some like cherry tomatoes and you know, there's mini cucumbers. I love those. I don't usually buy them because they're so expensive and there's so much plastic, but I'm like, well, we're going on a picnic, might as well treat myself. So yeah, he's getting up at eight, then I'll get dressed, um, and then we can go to get the last bits that we need. Also, new plug, well, not new, 
but my usual one broke and I just, I can't buy it anywhere. It doesn't exist anywhere. Uh, and I'm really sad because I had it for years now and it was my favorite and really comfortable. So I just bought some like silicone ones. This is just plastic. But I bought some silicone ones because I can't really, I can sleep with this one, but I feel like it's gonna fall out eventually. Because I don't know when I'm sleeping anyway. So yeah, I need to stop rambling. Carry on reading my new book, which I'm really excited about. Apparently it's good. And then, as I said, I will show you when I get stuff together for the picnic. Hello. So, before we leave, we'll leave at 10.30. My friend is coming. Um, she's coming with us. I, again, can't remember the name of that place, by the way. But I will. Suicide Spot. Yeah, that's not helpful. That's not what it's called. Um, I have it probably written down somewhere. Kennel. Oh, is it? Okay, well done. Uh, yeah, so we're going to have to pop to... Like, there's a Hermes shop nearby because Matthew's sending a little package for his dad for, for Father's Day. So we're going to do that and then we pop to Sainsbury's. What? Oh, shit. Oh, you can just pose there. Is that pretty? I forgot the card. Uh, and then you need to send the one that says about your mom hard drive. Um, yeah, so we need to pop to Sainsbury's because I found this. Okay, I just want to buy some like dumbbells and whatever. And I just found this. Like, I don't know what I'm doing, so I don't want to spend like a shit ton of money. So I found this set in Argos for like 35 quid, so I'm happy to pay that. So I'm gonna pop there and it's an Argos within Sainsbury's and I wanted to get some like reduced fat hummus in small pots and last time I got it um, it was from Sainsbury's so I'm gonna get one of those for the picnic as well. Maybe some vegan cocktail sausages for the Matthew. <laughs> so yeah we're just gonna pop to Sainsbury's and Argos and then we will come back put all the food together. Shall we toast some of the flatbreads I cut up and toast them or should we just take them as, as they are fresh I don't know we'll see anyway I'm gonna go now because reasons and then I will be back with showing you what I made for the picnic so here is the picnic the picnic stuff that we're taking these are Matthew's sandwiches We've got some of this. This is my absolute favourite. I shouldn't be eating this because it's going to mess my tummy up because I don't eat soy anymore, but whatever. We've got some vegan cocktail sausages and egg bites from Sainsbury's and these mini sausage rolls. Some hummus. I'm trying to, like, make myself having to do portion control by buying portions. So one of these that we probably have. We've got some cherry tomatoes. We've got two vanilla cupcakes if anyone wants them this is for me i made baked oats so i have something sweet that isn't too bad we've got some rocky road as well again not for me and then i made some homemade falafels they are amazing they're a little bit crumblier than i like them so next time i'll use like a flax egg or something oh we also have some apricots and some strawberries and coke and strawberry water so yeah this is the picnic. We're just like having to carry this up all the way on the hill. The beginning of the hike naive positive full of hopes 
I'm gonna die halfway up probably, but um, yeah, yeah, we will die together. Let's do this. So we've just, well not just, we had our picnic and I think we're going back to the car park. I fucking hope so because I'm dying. It's really warm and it's a lot of uphill. But hills be like that. Um, the scenery is beautiful at least. I'll show you some of it. And yeah, it's been fun. Hello. We are back in the car. Hello, Danny. We're back in the car. We survived. It's really warm. It was really sunny. I had to put on my jumper and stuff like that. It was fun. Picnic was good. And we're heading home now because I had enough of the sunshine. That's about as much as I can handle when it comes to sunshine. So we're just gonna go home get some water on the way home and we need to grab some drinkies because we're taking some to the pizza dinner and then have a shower because I'm a sweaty mess that's covered in sun cream so yeah it was a lovely 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 morning and I was saying that we need to do this more often but next time I'm doing this I'm not really going to look at my phone so it might not be oh I love that uh, the straw thingy it's very Hungarian actually we have a lot of those houses yeah sorry I get uh, distracted easily so yeah we're gonna do these like nature walks and that more often hopefully because it feels good and it makes you sweat and it makes you sweat in a good way and you're outside and you're breathing fresh air and get out there people and do your walkies because trust me it's good so yeah I shall be back um, to show you the pizza and stuff like that. If anything exciting happens before that, I should show you that as well. Do you know the lyrics? Doesn't matter. Become. It's gonna take a lot to take me away from you There's nothing that a hundred men or more can ever do I bless the rains down in Africa It's gonna take some time to do the things we never had the up ones. Quality content guys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. As long as, as soon as you have something in front of you that you can see yourself in. Everything is a mirror. If you're brave enough. She's waiting there for you. Hello, 
<laughs> so we're home now. Um, Joe's got home, basically. It's like half nine, something like that. Um, we went to eat pizza. Like homemade pizza and it was uh, amazing. Really nice. Um, I haven't died yet of the cheese. I feel like I might eventually. <laughs> Hopefully not though. But yeah, it was really nice. We had a lovely time um, with other friends and we met little Evie who's like a little dodo and she's the cutest thing ever. I forgot to film any of the pizza because it was so good we just kept eating it. <laughs> So I will put a picture here that I didn't even take. Matthew took it. And then I'll put a picture of Evie up there as well because she's so cute. I love doodles. I love cats too, don't worry. Obviously. Um. So yeah, I was going to do some... Oh, I didn't even say, did I say? I think I might have done, but I bought some dumbbells and stuff. I wanted to do some stuff with that, but not happening. It's half nine. I feel like I could go to sleep right now, but yeah. Um, awesome day, busy, but really nice. And tomorrow we've got some painting to do, which I'm not looking forward to, but oh well. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna get into my pajamas, take my makeup off, which is very minimal nowadays because the piercings are still healing. Um, wait, I'm gonna take that off get my pyjamas on and probably chill on the sofa and I really want to have a slice of um watermelon and I really shouldn't but I probably will knowing myself so yeah I will be back tomorrow hopefully something exciting will happen but yeah for tonight I'm just gonna head off and hello it's around 12 something um we've been at my friend's cafe we're trying to like paint things and uh, it's just a lot um just came home to grab some more tools and some lunch and to feed the boys um after this we're going to go back there and then i will walk to the gym go there for a little bit walk back and then this evening we're gonna go and see um Grease at a castle it's like an outside one and um, we can take our own food and popcorn and just sit on the grass or like we've got foldable chairs so we will probably take those plus a picnic blanket as well so i'm really excited about that because i love grease obviously um i wish i could like get dressed up and everything but to be fair because of the new piercings i can't really do makeup properly so i probably won't do that i'm really excited about that and yeah that's the plan so i'm just gonna get um my stuff together and go to the gym i'm gonna walk there from my friend's cafe so i get my steps in as well hopefully so yeah i wanted to have some lunch as well then i realized i'm going to the gym and i'll probably throw up so i'm not having lunch i'll just have some food um when we come back what's this oh i had a coffee yes <laughs> so yeah that's the plan i haven't filmed this morning because we literally just got up had breakfast and had it over there and it's not very exciting to be honest so yeah that's why i haven't filmed but i will film on the way to the castle cinema thing and then i'll show you what's happening there we'll take like a picnic sort of thing i guess um whatever we have from the picnic left over yesterday and some popcorn obviously because popcorn <laughs> i'll be making some microwave popcorn with my trusty popcorn maker it's the best thing in the history of the world. Two thousand years later. I am Lipstick Lady. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so, oh my god, it's so warm. So we are heading off to the cinema. Like an outdoor cinema. We've got some blankies to sit on the floor and some chairs as well. Just in case some very tall people sit in front of us. I'm going to watch Greece, as I said earlier, I think. So, this morning we went to the cafe that we were going to paint and then we went. But we did some stuff there and then I went to the gym for about an hour. I did some upper body workout. This is in my face. Uh, so my arms are like feeling weird. Uh, but it was really good. And then... We came home, got ready, and now we're off to the cinema. 
Um, we will love the boil food. Starts. Okay. Um, so yeah, really exciting. I'm munching on cherry tomatoes. We've got some snacks in the back. I made some popcorn quickly. I wanted to make so many snacks and then I just wasn't at all on top of anything. <laughs> I need to make my crunchy... What? Oh. I need to make my crunchy chickpeas and stuff like that. Didn't happen. So, anyway, I've got popcorn. That's what matters. Cinema isn't cinema without popcorn. So, yeah. It's going to be fun, hopefully. Uh, honestly, I shouldn't have put this lipstick on. My hair is just sticking to my lips because it's not, um, oh no, it's not a matte one. So, also, I look a bit weird because I don't have any foundation on because still, new piercings. So, no foundation, I only have eyeliner and lipstick. So, it's a little bit weird, but, you know, I'm just going with the flow. Uh, so, yeah, I'm off and then I will probably show you happens in the cinema if I don't forget about it by the way I forgot to say which is the most important part apparently according to Matthew about the cinema <laughs> he keeps doing that and another day the other day which was yesterday I think a car thought that he was um, swearing at them and they went in front of us and broke really heavily braked or broke right braked <laughs> they broke <laughs> I can't English sometimes. But yeah, he swears at me all the time. Oh, woe is you. Hmm? Oh, woe is you. I don't know what that means, but sure. Uh, so, yes, the cinema is not actually in the cinema. It's at a castle. It's an outside cinema. I forgot to say. I think I forgot to say that. So yeah, we're going to the castle to watch Greece. Because what else would you be doing on a Sunday afternoon, right? And he had a go at me for not saying that it's at the castle because that's the most important part, not like watching Greece a million times. It's about all about the castle. The castle. The castle. So, yes, we're going to a castle.
if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up or two you can't give two thumbs up to the video can you? Uh, and also if you would like to see more of my face and Matthew's shoulder then you know what to do click on the subscribe button and the notification bell and you will never miss a video from me because why would you want to um, also if you want to you can follow me on Instagram where I post a lot of selfies too many some might say a lot of pictures of my kitty cat oh! 